All right, folks, we're here live at Pittsburgh Intermediate School here, and we're talking weather. I'm standing by live right now. Tell everybody at home what your name is, and tell us something that you learned about our visit today. We had so much fun, right? My name is Cindy, and, well, <laughs> I, I like the projects you did. Okay, yeah. Now, out of the projects, what was your favorite project? The cloud. Oh, I like the cloud, too. The cloud and the ball is always fun. You know, it's hard to believe we can make weather right here in our own hands with the materials that we have on Earth. That's pretty cool, right? Tell everybody at home what your name is and uh, what is something that you learned about today? My name is Drew, and I learned... Uh... <laughs> I don't know. What about the water cycle? You remember that? Oh, yeah. I, d I learned that sleet was one of them that's right you know all the people forget that one a lot of adults forget that even i forget that sometimes so it's a pretty important one now tell everybody your name you got an important job people need to know what to expect for lunch right yes sir my name is corlin worth and it's going to be cold so grab a jacket hey that's right grab a jacket you heard corlin let's take a look at this forecast folks current temperatures still fairly cool out there with plenty of sunshine and then as we take a look here at the forecast here for future cast we're going to go into the midday time frame we're looking at again temperatures staying cool right on into your afternoon wednesday afternoon temperatures may hit maybe 60 degrees if we're lucky we'll keep our fingers crossed on that as we head towards your thursday morning though that's when we see some big changes it's going to turn quite cold and yeah even possibly Possibly frosty across the region, so get ready for that. But by Thursday afternoon, though, look at that sunshine, dry air. It cools down quickly, but it will also heat up fairly quickly as well. So I think our temperatures get back into the low to mid 60s. Now, I want to take a look at our threat tracker for the rest of the week because it's fairly low in the coming days. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, it's a fairly low on the first alert threat tracker. But by the weekend, we start to raise the dials a little bit. Notice the yellow creeping in because we're talking about the potential of a cold, wet weekend here and quite a bit of rain moving across the area. So we'll be watching that in fact take a look at your weekend setup by friday afternoon we'll be seeing dry weather but friday night into saturday notice saturday morning rain starts to move in with that low pressure moving across the area but cold air is also building in as well so it's going to stay cold and wet all day saturday right into your sunday morning rain will stick around it'll be breezy it will be a raw windy cold day so get ready december will feel like december as we head towards this weekend as you can see in your seven day forecast we've got the 60s with sunshine the next few days but by the time we head towards the weekend cold wet and windy man get ready it's going to be a big change across the area but we do start to trend a little warmer by the beginning of next week but i have a feeling it gets much colder by the end of next week all right we're back out here and to continue on just tell everybody again if they're heading out for this afternoon what kind of weather can they expect my name's Christian, and it's going to be sunny and cool. All right. Christian says sunny and cool today, but, hey, we got to know about tomorrow morning as we get ready for the bus stop. The kids got to go to school, right? I'm Colton, and tomorrow morning is going to be cool and frosty. All right, all right. And then and tell us just one last time here about that forecast here for the weekend. It's going to be cold and rainy. Cold and rainy, folks. There you have it. So we're going to get ready and toss it back to you guys. But, again, there you got the forecast. A lot of changes on the way. Make sure you check our website out to get the details. You better watch out, Cedric. They're going to have your job here before you know it. <laughs> Y'all have fun out there. Millie